Hello everyone. Welcome to Story Recaps. Today, I am going to explain a 2014 thriller film, Black Sea. Hope you like it. The story starts with the captain of the ship named Robinson. In the beginning, he was serving in the Navy. But now he has been working under the company Agora for 11 years. The company's task is to search the wrecked and sunk ships. One day, this company dismisses some of its employees including Robinson. Robinson is depressed because of his sudden termination from his job. Because he had been segregated from his wife and son during these 11 years. Being busy, he never attends to them so his wife had left him. He went to his school to meet him. Robinson watched him from the car while he was going home with his mother. But he didn't try to meet him. He is sitting with his friends in a bar. Robinson also has a friend named Kirsten. He is also dismissed from the firm. Kirsten is worried, taking a matter because he is debtor. He also takes anti-depression pills. Robinson also talks about his 12 years old son Martin and his wife. Then, Kirsten reveals a secret to them about Black Sea and asks for his help. Now in the next scene, we see that Robinson and his friend visit an investor. They tells him the story about Hitler and the Black Sea. The Black Sea is surrounded by five countries and its depth is 2,200 meters. Hitler's army Nazi was completely destroyed in 1941. Russia was still safe from the war threats. But Russia had fear of the attack of Germany. Taking advantage of it, Hitler loaned two ton of gold from Russia. Its cost may be estimated as a ship was filled with gold by Hitler, taking the boat from Russia. But that ship did not reach to Hitler. Either it sank into the sea while sailing or was conspired to sink. Consequently, Hitler attacked Russia. Millions of people met their destiny during a four years battle. They reveal that the search was done by Agora in the Black Sea. And they find out about the U-boat. They claimed it was the same boat where the gold was placed. They went to the Georgia government and revealed the location of the U-boat. The Georgia government agreed to take it out. And war broke out between Georgia and Russia. And limits begin to cross. Russia was unknown about the U-boat location while Georgia was aware. But no one could enter the Black Sea until the dispute was resolved. And that U-boat will remain sunk in the sea. Knowing about it, Robinson discusses it with the investor. Because the expense may take a peek in this research. And finance is in dire need of it. The investor agrees to invest in it, but he wants to take 40% of all gold in return. Robinson agrees and starts gathering the man. A minimum of 12 members is needed to sail a submersible. Meanwhile his friend Kirsten commits suicide under depression. In the beginning, he buys an old submarine. There is a Russian friend with Robinson whose name is Blackie. They arranged a crew of 12 people including half English and half Russian. Robinson selects the Russian staff because they had taken a Russian submarine. And Russians will prove helpful in order to escape from their countrymen. Some employees are employed to do stuff like safeguard the engine, gold, and cook. They necessitate a seasoned diver, so they hired a refrigerator, an enthusiastic and expert diver. They sail in the sea after arranging a team and submarine. Robinson, last time, has a look of blue sky and they all sail the submarine into the sea after closing its door. Each member of the team takes his duty and they go for the exploration of the gold. Everything is alright till now. Gathering all, Captain provides information to them. He mentions gold and says everyone will be awarded an equal share of the gold from the rest of 60%. Because 40% of gold is owned by the investor. Daniels is the assistant of the investor. Daniel advises Robinson that you should not say as such. Having lust in their heart, they may kill one another. Because their share will be lessened in this way and the captain should not utter so. After a risky search they reach the location of the U-boat, suddenly, a Russian ship crosses them. They save themselves by stopping the engine. After some time a fight starts between Russians and other people. And due to this the main shaft explodes with a blast. Everyone in the submarine got injured. Robinson fainted for almost 18 hours. Now the whole crew was divided into two parts. So Robinson goes to Russians to make a peace now, Robinson manages to make peace with Russians and other group peoples. After talking with both the groups, they plan to bring the propeller shaft of the U-boat for their submarine. As their own shaft is blasted and they cannot move submarine without it. Then they wear scuba suits and went outside to search the U-boat. They find the U-boat. Going into it, they also get the propeller shaft of the submarine. Along with it, they also find the gold inside it. So they decided to take it out along with the shaft. They brought carriage that could not carry the heavyweight, which basically had come to take the propeller shaft of the submarine. As a result, the carriage got heavy and it takes force to drag. They are taking that carriage to the submarine but it is blocked. As a result they lose the control of carriage, and some of the gold is dropped by them. They returns with the propeller shaft. 
all are dejected at the loss of the gold. And they try to drive submarines on the surface. But Daniel, the assistant of Lewis, reveals a secret to Captain Robinson. As it has been conspired. There is no Lewis or rich investor. Actually, Agora had compromised with Georgia. Because it is risky for them to take out the boat. Agora members had planned it, and they dismissed all the capable employees of the firm. And being compelled, you all got ready to take revenge and money from this firm. Agora gave $30,000 to Kirsten in order to tell you everything. And you are easily entrapped. As you moved on the surface, taking the gold, Agora could take all the gold from you, arresting all of you. Hearing it, Robinson has gone mad in anger and he also thinks the company may show its inhuman side. He tells everything to other people and they get angry. They wanted to kill the assistant but Robinson didn't let him do that. The dropped gold could not be gained again but there was still some gold left with them. Now they change their plans and will not proceed to their chosen location to avoid Agora. They fix the new propeller shaft but they are doubtful of its working. They knew, either they will get freed from here or entrapped here forever for dying. They start the engine of submarine and it begins to work. They are joyful thinking about their future changing high status. Moving at a distance, they come to know about the rocks on its ways. They try to stop the submarine but it hardly stops. There is something wrong in the portal and chart. So the submarine is caught in the rocks. They could cross these rocks, passing 40 meters. Taking the help of each other, they try to get free from the rocks. Suddenly, there is an explosion in the submarine because of rocks. And there is a hole in the submarine. As a result, it started to build up water. And the submarine has started to sunk into the sea. They try to maintain water flow, but it is pointless. Except for Robinson and his two companions, everyone died in this accident. Robinson saves the lives of his mates but dies himself. Because one person was needed to control the submersible. He also manages to send the gold out for his two companions. And he is left behind with a submarine in the sea forever. The movie ends here. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more such movies explanation. And hit the like button to support our work. See you next time.